Hello everyone, my name is Katie Hustis and today we're going to be talking about how to begin playing the French horn. To start, what you'll do is you'll get your French horn. Um, there's many different types you can get. Mine is a double horn, which has, um, it's an F horn, and then there's thumb B flat, which gives you the B flat fingerings. Um, once you have your horn, mine is already out of the case, but when you go to take it out of the case, you want to carefully grab it out by one of the sturdy parts of the horn. You don't want to grab one of the movable parts, so not one of the slides or the valves. Um, and what you want to do is carefully lift it out. And once you have it out, um, there's a few different things. So you have the bell, which is this. You have your slides. You have your valves. Um, and then you have your mouthpiece. And your mouthpiece, um, you have the stem of the mouthpiece right here. And so what you want to do is you want to set that into your horn. You don't want to push it in because there's possibility of it getting stuck. So just set it in. Um, and what you want to do when you go to start playing is you want to hold the horn up like this. So it's at your mouth. And to do that, most of the horn is resting on my leg. And then I just have my fingers on the valves and this little pinky rest right here. Um, I'm just resting my pinky in it. And so when you go to start playing, you want to take your right hand like a princess wave or like a little cup and you want to put it in the bell. You don't want to stick it in because that will muffle your sound, um, but you want to put it on the right outside edge um, so that you're not covering it too much. And this will help with the intonation of the horn. Um, but your right hand is not um, holding the horn. It's just there to help with the intonation. When you go to start playing, um, the first thing you have to do is um, find the placement of your lips on the mouthpiece. And so when you go to start playing, you're going to want two thirds of your upper lip in the mouthpiece and one third of your lower lip. Um, to find your first note and start playing, most beginner horn players start on a horn pitch C. Um, and in order to find what that is for concert pitch, you're going to go down a perfect fifth from the horn pitch to find the concert pitch. So if I'm starting on horn pitch C, I'm going to go down a perfect fifth. So it's going to be C, B, A, G, F. So if I were to find that note on the piano, I would play a concert F. And then I would play that note and try and match it. And it's an open fingering to try and match that. And so you want to try and find it. Once you find that, you can learn some of the other fingerings. Um, a good book that I recommend is the Jump Right In book. Uh, we used it all semester, and they have a lot of be good beginner pieces for you. Um, today I'm going to be playing London Bridge, um, and then America, and then I'm going to end with We Wish You a Merry Christmas. Um, I hope you enjoy. This is London Bridge, and it starts on a horn pitch C, and so that's going to be a concert pitch F. As you could tell, there's a little bit of popping in my sound when I was playing. Um, what that is, is it's the water in your horn. It um, gathers the more that you play. And so what you can do is you can take your horn, take the mouthpiece out first so it doesn't fall out. Um, and you're just going to turn it like this and the water should come right out. Um, if you still have more water in there, you also have what's called a water key. Mine is right here. And so all you're going to do is you're going to take the water key and you're going to push it and you're just going to blow some air. And that should get some of the water out. Okay, next I'm going to play America. And America starts on horn pitch F. And so that's going to be concert pitch B flat. Mm -hmm. 
slides back here and all you do is you carefully pull the slide out a lot of your water gets caught in these and so you just take it out and empty it and then you put it right back in like this and if the slide won't come out don't pull on it too much you don't want to bend the slide um, We Wish You a Merry Christmas starts on a horn pitch G. So that's going to be a concert pitch C. of the French horn, how to put it together, um, the different parts of the horn, and how to start playing. I hope you enjoyed.